Ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the arrival of Her Excellency, President Halima Yaakob, and our national anthem. President Halima Yaakob arrives for the grand occasion in the traditional red and white of Singapore. President Halima is the eighth president of Singapore and the first female president in Singapore's history. Madam President, the parade is formed up and ready for your inspection, ma'am. President Halima Yaakob will now inspect the parade. As a mark of respect, the 25-pounder guns will fire in salute to the president. You're hearing the shots fired from the 25-pounder howitzers, and there'll be a total of 21 shots as part of the presidential gun salute. The president is escorted by the Chief of Defence Force, Vice Admiral Aaron Bing, and Parade Commander, Lieutenant Colonel Rugumaran, son of Davindran, for the parade inspection. The 21 gun salute is conducted almost exclusively for the president during National Day parades. It's executed by the gunners from the 21st Battalion Singapore Artillery on board the M3G floating rafts operated by the 35th Battalion Singapore Combat Engineers at the Merlion Park. will now conduct her customary inspection of the Guard of Honor contingents, beginning first with the 1st Commando Battalion. That's a unit with a very proud history. 
After winning their 18th consecutive Best Combat Unit Award, they've now taken home the award an incredible 35 times overall. The president stopping now to compliment a soldier and a proud moment with his young man. All the more poignant given that this is the last year that President Halima will be inspecting the Guard of Honor Parade as president. And the president approaching the Navy Guard of Honor contingent, made up of men from the Naval Diving Unit. They too have a proud heritage as one of Singapore's elite units. Naval divers are known for their physical and mental strength. And even though they're at home underwater, they can also take on missions in the air and on land. And the Republic of Singapore Air Force Guard of Honor contingent is comprised of men and women from the Air Power Generation Command. Its job is to ensure that the RSAF is able to deliver the air power required to complete its missions. It includes turning around aircraft, servicing and maintenance, and integrating operations across the four air bases. Next, President Halima inspects the newly inaugurated Digital and Intelligence Service. The DIS plays a critical role in defending Singapore from threats in the digital domain, allowing SAF to operate better as a networked and integrated force to deal with new and evolving external threats, as well as to safeguard Singapore's peace and sovereignty. And finally, here's the Singapore Police Force Guard of Honor Contingent from Training Command. All police officers must pass through the command to ensure that they have the requisite operational and soft skills to ensure that Singapore remains safe and secure. President Halima Yaakov will now embark on her ceremonial vehicle drive past. This is her sixth National Day Parade as Head of State. Come on, Singapore! Let's show our appreciation to President Halima Yaakov by waving our flags as the vehicle drives past you. President Halima making her way around the Padang on her ceremonial vehicle for the last time in her sixth and final NDP. Madam Halima is well loved by the people for her dedication to strengthening the voices of our communities and uplifting those most in need. What you're looking at now is a video montage of the organizers have prepared for the highlights of her six-year presidency the and also her past involvement in NDP. President Halima Yaakov is known as a people's president who is a strong advocate for social issues long before she was elected. Her presence at the National Day Parade is a reminder of her commitment to Singapore and Singaporeans from all walks of life. A people's president, Madam Halima's engagement at the parades went well beyond ceremonial inspections and tours. For many, she was the spark of encouragement that Singaporeans needed, embodying the leadership that showed she was with us during one of the darkest moments of Singapore's history. Her involvement in various causes, her willingness to engage through various platforms brought us hope and encouraged all of us to press on. 
to plant seeds of kindness, to step forward as one people, and to not just look after our own needs, but to care for those around us. As your term comes to a close, Madam President, we say a heartfelt thank you for everything you've done. Warming and joyous moment as the crowds and contingents are gathered here today to celebrate Singapore's 58th birthday together with our president. The Guard of Honor will now execute the Feu de Joie, or Fire of Joy, to celebrate our nation's birthday. Kawalan kohormatan akan tembak Feu de Joie. Isikan peluru. Hormat. Tembak. Isikan lagi. Hormat. Tembak. Isikan lagi. Senja! Ha! Kawalan Kehormatan! Rusuk! Senja! Ha! 